Can you hear me now? <laughs> Hopefully you can hear me now. I just got home. So I uh, was saying, saying <laughs> that today was my first day as a team lead, officially as a team lead. I've already been performing some of these duties for a couple of weeks now uh, to get a little bit trained up. But today was the first official day. So that was that was really cool. I got to train a couple new people. Um, I think they're going to do well. They were both very confident for first for it being their first day. Um, I'm sure that their numbers will improve with experience as they get better at their rap. And um, I think they'll they'll ultimately do well. Um, tomorrow we start. A new campaign. I'm really excited. We're going to be launching another campaign. And that's why they're bringing in more team leads, more people. Because they need to expand. We've got a lot of stuff. A lot of, a lot of irons on the fire. And um, I had a really interesting door today. I only got about three and a half hours of walk time. Because... Um, I was training in the morning, right? So, this is somewhere around three, three and a half hours of walk time. But I did collect about a half day's worth of signatures, and that's about a half the shift. So, I think I was still kind of on par with where I needed to be signature collection-wise. Um, one of the doors I knocked on was a Democrat, and he wanted to know if because the second petition is a state proposition to get nurses into dialysis clinics because currently there is no um, supervision from a doctor or a nurse required in dialysis clinics i have a little bit of wind damage going on here not really damage but stuff is blown around um so once the winds die down, I can set my tarp back up, but I can't do it while it's this windy. It's still kind of windy. Santa Ana winds. Um, so I was talking to this fella, and he wanted to know if the people uh, behind the state proposition supported AB 1400. So for those of you who don't know, AB 1400 is the California single payer health care bill. And it recently passed the health care committee. And now I think, I don't know if the vote was yesterday or not. I, I haven't heard the latest on it, but it was going to the appropriations committee. And yes, the California Nurses Association does support AB 1400. In fact, they've been doing a lot of the organizing behind lobbying the assembly people to get it passed. Um, so I was able to have that conversation with him at the door and I told him, I told him, you know, you're lucky you got me because I actually follow this stuff. <laughs> I don't know that everybody on the team, the team leads do, the team leads do. We follow this sort of stuff, but um, a lot of a lot of our canvassers are hotel employees, and so they're not as deeply involved in politics as the rest of us. And um, had he gotten any one of the other canvassers, I'm not sure that they could have answered that question for him. So I did make sure and. Um, bring it up in our chat so that the rest of the team if they ever get that question it's first time I've gotten it in three months but um, I did get it and he was pleased that I could you know speak to it right away and he signed both petitions so that worked out well so I'm gonna be commuting to LA for a, for a while <laughs> I have a lot of commute time going in for a while now um, I don't know how we're going to mix up the various cities and what we're going to do to finish the campaigns in the other two cities, but I'm sure there's a plan somewhere. We're launching another one tomorrow. Very excited. Very excited. Um, so I'm steaming my mask. Make sure it's sanitary. And uh, am I going to have some of that turkey casserole I made last night? Hope you're all having a great Saturday night. I was kind of hoping... The shaman would be uh, doing his Twitch party, but I don't see him going live, so I guess that's not happening. 
Because it's already, he, he's on East Coast time. It's like already close to 1030 over there. Oh, well. Maybe I'll sing. <laughs>